Hello and welcome to IBM TV. Today I'm joined by Mark Davies, Director of Products and Technology for TSL Products. Mark, welcome to IBM TV. Hi, thank you for having us. Can you start by telling us a bit about TSL Products, please? So yeah, TSL Products uh, has been around for a number of years. We're actually um, the product division of what was the TSL Systems company. But as the years went by, they needed a number of special products des designed for themselves. And we could see there were market opportunities for other system integrators to use these products. So TSL Products was set up as a separate company from TSL. As they say, the rest is history. We're very successful, uh, growing, um, and looking forward to the new challenges, particularly uh, standards coming along such as IP. Excellent. So what are you guys up to here at BBE? Uh, so we have a number of products we're showing here from our Tallyman control system, which is always growing, new applications. Uh, we're showing a virtual panel on that here. Um, and it's way more than uh, a traditional tally system that people have come to know and love. So we have new applications that we're putting into the market at the moment, such as uh, touch screen control of um, pan, tilt and zoom cameras, so allowing for remote productions. So not forgetting our core, it's still a great tally system, we can do all that good stuff, but spreading it out to be a full blown control system with a full range of panels, both the virtual panel, which has really been a hit. So the virtual panel now is actually counting 50% wall panel sales, um, plus we have the one and two U traditional LCD button panels. So that's on the control side. We also have uh, our Insight and IDS, which allow the control to span into digital signage and also monitoring of the power supply and health condition of the rack rooms, both in traditional broadcast, but also in modern data centers going through that. And then we also have here um, a whole range of conventional audio monitors, which audio is obviously what TSL products is best known for, and we're expanding that range at the show. So it sounds like you've got lots going on there, Mark. We have, absolutely. And yeah. so what's, what's in the future? What can we see next from TSL products? So one of the new products we have here in the audio monitor range is actually the, what we call the PAM-IP, which is, um, an, as its name says, an audio monitor for the IP um, age. So the version we're launching here at the show has 2022-6, uh, which really is everybody's first toe in the water with IP. It's wrapping up all of the SDI with all of the audio and all of the data into one. So you can make no mistakes, you can transmit what you can put on an SDI coax o over an IP infrastructure through COT switches. So we're really excited about that. There's obviously early adopters who put full IP systems in at the moment. So that's a new product we're here, but going forward to the future, we're, we're making a commitment to look after our early adopters and our users. So at the moment we know 2022-6 is what's adopted and ratified and people are really making TV programs. Obviously everyone's getting excited about the benefits TRO3 and TRO4 can bring, particularly when that gets standardized and wrapped up into 702110. So we're committing on that platform going forward to support pretty much all of these standards that are on the AIMS roadmap. So AIMS standards body have done some really good work in saying, yeah, this is a sensible way to proceed through your path into full IP. And as a company, we're saying, yeah, we completely agree with that and we will support those standards as they're ratified on the PAM IP. It all sounds very exciting. <laughs> it is. Mark, thank you for your time. Okay, thank you very much. You can find out more at tslproducts.com.